Kanye West's new album. It's called Jesus. He dropped two new songs, both premiered on Saturday Night Live. Are you a Kanye West fan? No, sir. <laughs> Why not? Man, I've never really been. I, I mean, I, I respect that he's a great artist. Um, I, I, I definitely respect that he's a great producer. I think he's probably one of the 25, 20 best producers ever in hip hop. Um, I think his rapping is a little overrated because I don't think he's that great of a lyricist to me. Um, but, I mean, I heard his songs and they were like, because I'm forced to listen to that when it's all over Twitter and Instagram and the whole world and buildings and all this stuff. So I heard him and, and they were, they were cool. I mean, like, I, I feel like they were kind of contradictory to each other. Not that that is not like any other hip hop artist, but for the, as much press as it's getting, I don't know, like, I, I, just, I just don't gaga over it. I just really not, I just really don't care about a lot of stuff that Kanye does. Uh, you know, I don't know. You think he'll sell a million? Yeah, probably. I mean, it's hard to sell a million no matter who you are these days, but I'm just, all I want to say, and I told people like this, I was like, you better, this better live up to what we've been, all this crap, all these buildings, all this stuff that he set himself on, not doing a solo album for two and a half years, it better, it better pay off because, like, just like Watch the Throne, all this build up, I thought the album was whack. Like, I thought it wasn't very good. I thought that, cool summer. All the build up. It was whack. Like, so this better be on point for all this stuff. And and if, you know, I don't know. That, that's just, that's just what I, that's my opinion. So, it's safe to say that you won't be purchasing I definitely won't be purchasing. I'll probably listen to it. You know, I listen to, I listen to Washington. I mean, the, the illest joints on that were not even Kanye beats. Like, I thought, I thought the RZA joint was sweet. But I, you know, I don't know. I won't be purchasing it. Kanye hasn't made a beat for an album other than Otis. Like, that's the last beat he's made. Yeah. He, he only had one beat on Watch the Throne. Um, well, I mean, isn't, shouldn't, he's gonna, he's gonna do the beats on this album though, isn't he? I, I, I wanna, I wanna say I hope so. I mean, like, isn't from, it his stuff? I, I've, I, I assume the two songs I heard were his production. I'm feeling like Hit Boy would be his go-to guy right now. Could be, I think I, I think that kind of fits more with Jay, but um, I mean, he he produced all of his other solo albums. Like, I feel like he would be doing it again. Like, you know, so I don't think he. I think he's really not. He like college dropout days. He he. That was the whole thing. Like, he was very relatable back then. Now it's Givenchy this and Prada that, and I'm Armani. All this world stuff. And I'm like, this is so like. You're not relatable anymore. You're just talking about how much money you have. Fine, cool. But it's like, and everyone thinks like he's still the same artist. Like all the Kanye fans or stands are just gonna think it's good no matter what, which is sad. But I don't know. Whatever. That, that's that's my take on Kanye. I told you not to bring it up. I told you not that was not a good idea. But because <laughs> uh, now everyone's gonna hate me. Like, how do you say about Kanye? So.